this morning what we're going to do is start by thinking more a little bit more about our clever tales we'll have give a chance to reread that and i'm going to listen to jocelyn read today so she's going to read with me and i'm going to take notes now remember over on our chart over here mm -hmm. we talked about some of the things that we did that made our books easy our nonfiction mm -hmm. books so today while you're reading this see if you do any of these things because we said we used the photographs to help us figure out some words and ideas we had to think about what the words mean, not just what the words say, right? Uh -huh. Not just say the words. Um, we looked carefully at the words if we weren't sure about it. We put words and pictures together. We thought about patterns. We just did all sorts of big thinking in our nonfiction books, okay? Uh -huh. So here's your book, Clever Tales. So you're gonna read it in a either absolutely with no voice or just a very soft whisper voice, okay? So you'll read your book to yourself and you may, do, may need to read it two times. Okay, but be sure you're really looking carefully at all the words as you're reading and thinking about what you're reading. So here's one for us, and here's your books. All right, all right, Jocelyn. So I'm going to have you do some reading right here, and I'm going to take some notes on this while you read. Right, so let me write Jocelyn's name down here. All right. Lots of animals have tails. Some animals use their tails to help them get food. They use their tails in lots of different ways. To see, I put just a little check every time you're saying what the book says. Off you go. Crocodiles can use their tails to catch animals to eat. Crocodiles lay very still. So what was something that you did while you were reading? What was something you did that made your reading make sense to you? What'd you do? I looked at all the, I looked at all the index, so I knew what I went to the second page and I knew I was reading it. The Can you tell, show us one that you did? Which one did you pick from the index to go to? The scorpion. You did show us how you did that. Yeah. I put my hand right there and I knew the number eight, so I clicked it and I knew it was there. There you go. What was something else that uh, someone did? What'd you do on that? I just that the scorpion page. Uh -huh. When the scorpion makes it asleep, I notice it has like two eyes and its, its feet dig up in the ground and when it Stungs the insect and it grabs his nose's claws because it's because it's hands and it eats it like oh. like did a you, human. Yeah. Did you notice what Ahmed was doing when he was using his hands to show how it was happening? Mm -hmm. Sometimes that helps us to explain our thinking Mr. even more. Brown. Today, as we read, we have another book that has tales in it. It's called The Monkey's Tale. And in this book, we're gonna read about a monkey and some of the things that he does with his tail. Cleaning the upside down? Maybe so, it's we'll have crazy. to see what he does. Oh, now, crazy. yeah, now as we work together, we're gonna to make sure that we're waiting till everybody finishes their thought before we start to speak, right? So that's something that we've been working Can on I as a group. That's something we're working on as a group, is making sure when someone else is talking that we're waiting till they finish their thoughts. We don't wanna miss any ideas. Yes. Now, in this book, Clever Tales, we talked about how the different animals use their tails in really clever ways to find life. food mm -hmm, in real life. It's, and it's you know one of the things that we talked yesterday? Is it back in your bottom? One of the things we talked about yesterday was this whale right here and how the whale's tail was shaped perfectly to help him get food with it. Because remember how he slaps the fish and it stuns them? And remember how he said that when you have a flat part, Excuse you can me? slap someone with it. Like so hold your hand out here like it's a whale's tail, and your other hand's a fish. All right, slap that fish with the tail. <laughs> oh, yeah, and it kind of, it's the perfect shape, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. It's Excuse flat, me. the whale's like, tail's flat. Or it could do like, when you like yeah. slap your hands, you like feel stuff or hurting your body. Like, yeah, touch us. Touch yeah, us. I, I feel that. It, now I know how it feels like stunned. Oh, hands are flat. Oh, I, yeah. I know why you can't see his eyes because it's little. Oh, mm -hmm. I know. I know. And if you use the sharp okay. part, it, wait, wait, won't, it wait. won't do it. Only the flat part. Okay. Now um, touch us. This, um, um, 
I'm gonna hit it and, and, and like make the noise and then go like and then it gets really stunned. Really? All right, sit right down there on your bottom. Oh. The other animal we talked about was the crocodile. Remember how he swings his tail to knock the animals like the over? Signs. Yeah, he swings that tail. So look how long and strong that tail is. So the way the tail looks helps them to use it in a certain way. In our book today, we've got a little monkey right here. And this little monkey is not happy with his own tail. Because his tail is like zigzag. Look at that. So and, let's and take your can, monkey's tail. I think he's not good. I think he. I think because his tail is wiggly that he can't even, wiggly wobbly. He can't even use his tail. Well, let's see what he's thinking. So can you go in and find page two <laughs> and page three? Find page two and page three and smooth your book down because they're kind of new yet. Press them down. Make them stay open. Okay. Oh, the monkey's looking at the alligator so because he thinks that one's better. How did you know he's looking at the alligator's tail? Oh, oh, because there's a, there's a, no, it's not an alligator. It's the crocodile. Look, it shows, and then oh. it shows lines it shows the his eye. It shows a line at yeah. its tail. Oh, and how did you figure out it was crocodile and not alligator? Me? Because I noticed from this, this book? book, I remember from this, I pictured it, so that one, and it's crocodile. It's a crocodile. It's a crocodile. Oh, look at that. So you're remembering from here, you've seen that big word and before, have, and you put it here. It's because it had the S and that one had. It's because that one had an E and that one has an S, but it has to have an E. Mm -hmm. And this one has crocodile. Yeah. yeah. Now, really wrong. look at Monkey. What's Monkey looking at? Is he looking at the whole crocodile, or is he just looking at the tail? The, the spike tail. tail. Oh, mm. if, if mm. the, the crocodile is sleepy, so the monkey Ow. knows that the crocodile is not going to eat him. Oh, my goodness. I risk it. You'll be all right, sweetie. Now, take a look at Monkey's face. What do you think he's thinking? You're thinking, thinking about, about one of those tails. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. Because you say he wants to switch tails. Oh, mm -hmm. and you peeked up and saw some words. Go ahead and have a read up there and see what monkey right. is telling us up there. See what see if that fits with our thinking. He thinking. wants a tail that could swing and knock things over like a crocodile's tail. He does. I am not the so when the cro he wants to have the crocodiles too, so it has, it's better because he's looking at the spikes. Oh. And he wants the spikes maybe when animals like try to eat the monkey, and he has that too. The animals can go right in the spikes and hurt them. Okay. okay. What are you thinking, Corbin? Uh, excuse me, I'm Santi. His tail is good for holding, but 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 that's the only thing that he can do, I think, with his tail. And mm -hmm. and, then, and then he thinks that that this would have more stuff to do uh, with its tail. Yeah. So how does he? Does, does he think that the, does he go up and ask the crocodile? Nope. How no, does he get, how does he get that? He wants to sneak up and Ooh. switch tails. He sneaks up on him, doesn't he? And yeah, switches the he, tail. He can use tails, but if he, he can. Use the t if he cuts the tail, the crocodile is dead. dead. Mm -hmm. Now so remember, that's... this is a fiction story, so lots of things can happen that wouldn't happen in real life. Let's turn the page and see what happens next. Yeah, so now he's, tail. so now he's got this, Switch. This new tail. Ooh, look over on page four. What do you think? Look at Monkey's face there. What's he thinking? He's thinking of having the, the jaguar's tail. So over on page five, we see the, the jaguar coming up. What happens here on page four? What are you thinking there, um, Jocelyn? Um, he wants the jaguar's tail because um, his eyes Oh, so you're thinking over here. Look back on page four. And let's see what happens. So this is actually two different pictures. It's kind of tricky. So what does Monkey think when he gets the alligator tail? What's he do with it? He slaps the pineapple. What are you thinking, Christine? Um, he, he's getting some food. Does he like being able to, like, chop the pineapple down? Yeah. How do you know? Help, help, help. How do you know he's having a good time over there? Oh, yeah, because his because he said swish. So swish. Because the, his tail, his other tail is only for like holding trees and 
recording stuff, but this still has to knock down the stuff. Please, yeah, really hard. Oh, hard please. Hard to hold it, mm. eat it. And then here comes A jaguar. the jaguar. The big cat. The big cat, they yeah. called him in here. And what's Monkey thinking? Look at his face over here. Oh, he's hungry. Look at his face over here. What's he, he thinking? Some... Aiden, what's he thinking? He's Wait worried. a minute. What makes you think worried? Be because, because, because the jaguars are mean. Oh, so he's thinking he might eat him? Here, I'm gonna put this, yeah, there's that jaguar. You see him with the polka dot. Jaguar. I'm gonna put this right back here. Now. Take a look right here. Go up and have a read on these two pages and see what happens when Monkey sees Big Cat. I'll just receive. He took his look, tail. Look, look she. Look, she, she, oh, she oh, wait, Christine's talking. She, she's tapping. She, it's some clever tails. Yeah. She, wait, wait. She, she, pause she, for just a moment. Now, who's who's the person who's trying to get their thought out? Okay, so none of us, up. none of us are going to talk. Up. Christine, get your thought out. Um, she's tapping the the um, water. Him? She's tapping the water with her tail, um, to get fish so she could eat. Oh, and look Just at like the, the clever tail. Yeah, and, look at the monkey. What's, and, oh, and the and monkey. The, the jaguar is doing it too. Look at that. Oh, and what's monkey and then the monkey has the jaguar's tail. tail and it's Tipping it on the water oh too. Oh my gosh! Look at <laughs> look at monkey hiding in the bushes on page six. What do you know about monkey now? What are you thinking? What are you thinking, Aiden? He wants his tail. What are you thinking? He wants the jaguar's tail. Why does he want the tail? Do you think? Because he could catch fish and eat them. Interesting. Oh, all right. Let's turn the page and let's see what happens next. We're not even going to read that page yet. Look. Look and what happened. The monkey fell off a tree. Why do you hang on that? Because his toe's not good like the other toe he had. Yeah, because, oh. because jaguars do not go on trees oh. and do not hang their tails. Yes, they do. They oh. jump on trees. Do they use their tails to hang? No. no. Oh, so they see, he's trying to be monkey. He's trying so to be they eat something. Yeah, he's trying to be the monkey, isn't he? And then look, what's he? what do you think he's going to think when he's there he beside us? He wants the snake tail. tail. Oh, turn the page and let's see what happens with that. Now he took his tail, and yeah. the snake is thinking about the ja jaguar's tail. Like, <laughs> look at this. Look at that. What do you think he's thinking? He's like, what? This is not my tail. He's like, what? What? Look and at that question like, mark. <laughs> Monkeys, what? this is not oh, my yeah. tail. I noticed, I noticed all of the tails are over here. <gasps> Look at that. And what's he thinking over there? What's Monkey thinking okay. over him? He's like, he's okay. nervous as an animal. Oh, I, I think why? Because because he started to drag, and then and then the and then and then this tail wasn't dragging. So so that's oh. why he looked at his tail, and it was different from from oh. this part of the tail. Right. It's like polka dot and stripe. Yep. So let's turn the page and let's see now what's next. Is now he wants to Who's he going to come to next? A bug. Are you come back with us? And so you're talking about the same part with us? He wants its tail. Right no, he got to have Who's he seeing? No, and then he wants he, its tail. He, the monkey's looking at his tail. Oh, he because thinks he, he wants scorpion's his tail? tail has a, his tail looks like a scorpion. Oh. Is he a scorpion? All right, turn the page and see what happens. And then, then he bit the monkey's hand and then all the animals got mad at monkey. Oh, all right, go back to the very beginning of the story. Oh, all right, go back to the very beginning of the story. Oh, monkey. Very beginning. No, oh, a bad monkey. Okay, now we read a little bit of the book, but we didn't read the whole thing. So I want you to start from the beginning. Go ahead and read the whole thing to yourself. And when you finish, eyes look at me before you start. When you finish, I want you to look around at the other people. And if they're still reading, you go ahead back and start. I'm going to watch to see when everyone's finishing at the, uh, the entire book. But you may have time to read it more than once. All right, off you go. Back to reading. And you do not have to point if you don't need to point.
Katie, start us off with some of the things you were thinking about. So you're looking on, on the very, he's at the very beginning of the story. What are you thinking about that part? He was looking, I know he was looking at the crocodile's toes. Mm. Oh, um, uh, and, and, um, he wanted that tail, but it stinked his thumb. Then he yelled help three times, and all the animals ran to monkey. They said, we want all the tails back now. Go over to, yeah. Everybody go over to that yeah. page 14 when he gets stung. Yeah. All, over the, to that all page. the animals saw that it was monkey. Oh. When monkey they were just mad. Monkey switches tail back from all the males because the animals sealed his tail back. So the the jaguar gave the alligator's tail back, and the alligator gave mon monkey's tail back, and the monkey gave the snake back. Mr. And they all and monkey sitting on his tree. But uh, Miss Deborah, um, thanks for waiting till I'm at finish this talk. Miss Deborah, I see that these are all meat eaters. They sure are, aren't they? <laughs> yeah. What are you thinking? That, that, they, that, that, he, that he. Like, Who, which he? Say, say the name. The so monkey. You know. mm -hmm. um, um, he wanted to get the tail because, because, because it had that thing, that sting thing uh -huh. that could make them to sleep. But but it was but it was too pointy for you can grab oh. it. How do you think monkey says help help help? Because he oh because her. how's he gonna say that? Can you he, read it the way monkey might he read it? Help help help. help. Yeah. Ooh, lots okay. of exciting. What do you think? How would you say it? How did you read it in your head when you see him yelling? Uh, can you read it the way um, Santi he read it with a lot of expressions? See those exclamation marks? Should we all read it together? Yeah. Let's do. Let's read that line together. All right, you ready? Help! 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 help, help. 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 Yell, monkey. monkey. Yeah. And then, how did those animals? Do you think over here? How are they saying? This we want our tails back. back. How did they say that? We want our they tails said, back. They said it mad. How do you say it, mad? Can you read it, mad? We want our tails back. Look at you guys, such clever yes, readers you are. We, yeah. we have a lot of stuff in common Special. with clever tales. It does, doesn't it? Well, we'll have to notice some more of that tomorrow. Can you close up your book for me? And let's think a little bit about what we did today as readers, okay? All right, so sit down on your bottom. Let me think about some of the things I noticed you do today as readers that was so helpful for you. You really, really, really paid close attention to the details in the pictures. You were just noticing all these little things right away. You Was noticed that a compliment? It's absolutely a compliment. Look at how you were noticing all these little details like that arrow and look at the Z's. That means she's sleeping. That does mean he's sleeping. <laughs> and you were really thinking about how the characters were feeling. How many you know what I could tell? Oh, you know what I how I could tell? Because you said, look how he's smiling. He is so happy with that tail. And then you got over to here and you noticed, even like the little stars that made him dizzy. So our <laughs> illustrator helped yeah. us get some thinking. Okay. And then you know what you did that was so important? When you went up and you were reading the words, you were checking to see that the words and the illustration, how they fit together because that's what readers do. They don't just use the pictures and they don't just use the words. They have to put them together to make them make sense, don't they?